Well, designers, can you imagine a tool or a website where you should just scribble like children, type a basic chat GPT like description of your design requirements, and voila, you get to generate a high quality 360 render of your virtual environment just like that. <laughs> I mean, Episode number three, it's four, right? Now let's explore on module number four. In this episode, we will be discussing about the most revolutionary and the most craziest and the most amazing website that I've ever come across all this time, which is going to revolutionize the building and design industry. And I really, really believe uh, it is going to change how we entirely think about uh, filmmaking, um, architectural design, rendering, uh, and so many things. Let's quickly get dive into the applications of Skybox by Blockhead Labs, building virtual worlds with architecture and designers. In this course, we will be exploring the incredible world of Skybox and how it's revolutionizing the way architects and designers create virtual worlds. Join me as we dive into captivating stories, examples, and ideas that will ignite your imagination and keep you engaged throughout this journey. So let's have a quick introduction about what Skybox actually is. Skybox is a powerful tool that allows architects and designers to create immersive virtual environments that can be used for a varieties of purpose including design visualizations, training and entertainment. With Skybox, you can create stunning 360 panoramic view that transport users to virtual world, provide a unique and engaging experience. And imagine if you integrate softwares like these uh, to another software that is called as uh, with Skybox, you can create immersive narratives that take users on a journey through a virtual world. Providing a unique and engaging experience, let's explore some of examples of Skybox that can be used for storytelling. Now welcome to your world of Blockit Labs. This software is here to revolutionize the idea of virtual world. Now as you can see, these are the renders that we can create in few minutes. The AI tools available to create all this allows anyone in this world to create this wonderful storytelling experience. Here is a quick tutorial that I will make you go through using Blockhead Labs. The process is extremely easy, so I want you to focus on how we do it. All right, here we go. Let's quickly start and create this particular beautiful thing by going to blockheadlabs.com and click into Conjure World. And uh, you can quickly select the fantasy land and type the prompt. Let's say a forest land and here you go. This is how it looks. So let's, now let's uh, type a surface on an alien planet and create a realistic and create generate. And now we got this amazing looking render. We should be able to add few characters into it. And then, uh, then we are going to create this wonderful animation that you see. All right. All right. Let's hit the download button and quickly go through converto.co. Choose that particular file that you downloaded and select HDR and convert and you can download the new file and now you open up Unreal Engine get the first person template and name whatever you want all right and go to edit and plugins type in HDR so and then tick the box with this HDR backdrop and start now all right let's go to plus icon right here and lights and HDRI backdrop and this will create this example of a backdrop for you and let's just replace it with the image that we have already saved drag it down here uh, just drag it up to this particular content uh, content folder and then you can just drag it to the cube map all right and look at that this is just amazing and you can move around the world that you have created with the help of ai now go to the plus sign above and type pixel bridge and go to collections Go to environments and the natural and you can select any uh, assets that you want but we'll select Iceland and we can scroll down choose whatever asset you want and choose download and click add all right once you download it it's going to end up in a project folder and in different folders so let's filter it to static mesh and we can we can drag it down and add it to the virtual world that we have already created just to give it a little more depth and uh, more uh, characteristics and more realism to be very honest 
and we can arrange it in a way that it looks pretty realistic now you can even add more of crazy stuff to this particular render but i'll stick to this for now and you can also rotate around and navigate throughout your all uh, hdri and 3dx uh, environment all right so the next step is to add a character to this particular scene we're gonna select the paragon one since it's free and we're gonna select paragon muriel because this looks cool and add to project and here i want you to select all the show all projects and select the specific project and you're gonna see a quick uh, error message or uh, you can resolve it easily you just have to select 5.1 and keep adding the project and it will get into this find a character into the blueprint and drag it to the scene and place it in the right place and go to the animation mode drop down and use animation assets great now you have added your model and we're pretty much cool with how it looks and we're ready to make a movie out of it all right now let's go to this particular icon here and uh, add level sequence name it whatever you like and here we have a timeline click on the plus sign find all classes and find the camera action now you have a camera in this particular scene click on the track add to the sequences and add camera act now as you can see we have already created certain animation all right this is the beginning of what to create something wonderful now select your character go to the track and add to actor sequence and add your mural character all right so from this point on you can make it do anything you can make it walk you can make it fly you can do pretty much anything all right you can even make it a superhero landing all right so let's do a superhero landing click into animation type ultimate land and this will give you this one of the many animation that this character is uh, having uh, so in moving the timeline uh, you can select from anywhere here i think it looks pretty much cool from here and then and we can make it this a little bit slower so we can go right click properties and then we can go adjust the play rate to 0 0.5 all right which is about 50 percent all right now the animation will play extremely slow which is pretty cool all right now from now the animation looks pretty cool now it's time to add a little bit of uh, movement of camera so, so that it looks extremely cinematic so it's pretty simple all you have to do is uh, move around the camera the way you want it to be and then add the keyframes all right and keep the transform uh, section highlighted and from there on you, you type s and you tell camera that this is where the scene is going to start from and go a little bit ahead and select another keyframe over there type by typing s so as you see the movement of the camera is according to the keyframes that we have added it's as simple as uh, you know uh, video editing skills i think you should be able to figure this thing off it's pretty easy all right this is what we got so far it looks extremely cool as you can see it looks like a, a superhero movie once you have your movie clip let's go to cable.ai and create a video all right upload your movie clip continue to prompt and let's say you can and write what's happening in the scene you can say a cyborg woman standing up in style sci-fi sci and go to video settings and you can go low transform because you don't want to transform a lot of difference over here select the frame that you like and hit create video all right and voila this is amazing all right as you can see this is powerful storytelling tool uh, we created this amazing looking animation just so simply using ai now from here on sky is the limit you can create movies out of it you can create architectural virtual worlds where you can teach and show your clients about how the design is going to be you can do endless things by using this one powerful software and from here on this gets better all right since this is a very initial version and in the future things are going to go crazy all right you will be able to see uh, virtual worlds created by even a small kid they are mind blowing where you can learn collaborate and dream all right because the future of cinematography design gaming name it everything is going to change from this one revolutionizing tech now in collaborating all this with right tech you should be able to create wonders all right